Hey guys, welcome back to Tony's Outtoos. In this video, I'll be showing you how to overlay a video on CupCut. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest software just under this video. So let's get started. So the first thing we need to do here is we need to open up CupCut. And from here, we need to create a new project. So let's go ahead and click on new project. And from here, we need to choose our assets. So in this case, I'll be using this video here. Let's go ahead and select that and click on add. Now from here, we need to do next is we now need to start adding our overlay. They typically, whenever you actually open up your project here, whenever you're not selecting anything, you should be able to see a section that says overlay. Now in this case, let's go ahead and click on overlay here. And from here, let's go ahead and click on add overlay. Now from here, let's go ahead and choose the video that we want to use for the overlay. So maybe I want to use this one. And from here, click on add. Now, once you've added your video, let's go ahead and position it properly. So let's go ahead and resize it, make it a lot bigger. And from here, let's go ahead and choose the appropriate options for this one. Now, in this case, at the bottom of your screen, when you've chosen your overlay, you should be able to see a section that says supplies. So let's go ahead and click on it. Now, in this case, you will be able to start choosing the filter or type of splice they want to use here. So there's going to be a lot to choose from. So choose the, the one that you want to use. Now, by the way, if something is true uh, too dark or too bright for you, you could actually reduce the opacity for that. In this case, maybe you want to use filter here. As you can see, whenever you play your video, it's going to now have that overlook on that specific video. But in this case, that's about it. So if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.